Hey what is up, welcome back to another Grounded video. In this video I'm going to show you guys how to make spider traps using basketball hoops. Now the reason I use basketball hoops in here I'm about to demonstrate is basketball hoops take zero damage no matter what you do to them, unless you recycle them of course. So what the th problem was when I was trying to trap spiders is they would constantly destroy the things I was trying to trap them with. With basketball hoops not only is it a really good way of damaging them because they can't get through but you can still hit them, but they can't destroy the basketball hoop. Next step in this process is to go to an area with a lot of spiders and build a trap there. This trap is mainly for orb weavers, it works with wolf spiders, it can work with ants as well if you put it closer together and other insects like that, but you gotta change them up a little bit, wolf spiders maybe make the trap a little larger so because it has such a large hit range. Um, for things like stink bugs, it's going to be pretty hard because it's more of an AOE attack that it does. Same with the bombing beetles. Um, so you're going to have to change it up a little bit just depending. This is really just an outline or a base trap that you can change up to however you see fit. But what I find to be the easiest and most simple design for orb weavers is just putting a clay foundation down and building around it. Make sure that the hoops are close enough together where the orb weavers can't get through. Now I did have some problems with this basic layout. That's why I ended up building even more hoops around it so that they couldn't get through. And also with this basic layout, you could still get hit by the spiders. Um, if there's two spiders, it's going to be pretty difficult because they'll come from both sides and they'll be able to hit you. Uh, pretty easily so you're gonna watch out for that now obviously there's no way to avoid the spider web attack it does unless you just jump or move around a little bit you can do it that way but it's pretty easy to kill the orb weavers this way it's a lot easier than facing them 1v1 and I don't think it's that cheap either because you can still get hit you still have to be aware of your surroundings it costs resources to build this trap and it's not like you're just sitting there and a ton of orb weavers are coming around you and just dying you collect their loot blah 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 but this is just really the outline. Basketball hoops, me getting it out there that they're indestructible and you can use them as traps. I want people to now build different traps, have spikes on the side, have, you know, I ended up putting a basketball hoop in the middle and then having the flower aroma trap or whatever it's called on the top of the basketball hoop. And this was done because the ore weavers and other spiders couldn't attack the flower directly so it wouldn't get destroyed. Well anyway, that covers the main topic of this video. Before I go though, I want to tell you guys how much I appreciate all the support on my channel currently. Grounded is taking off and I really do love this game and I'm excited to do more videos in the future. If you have any recommendations on what you want me to do, please put it in the comments. I'd be glad to look at it and possibly do it in the next video. But that's all I have for today. If you enjoyed, then please hit the like button, sub in your many sub, and turn notification bell on if you want to see more of these videos in the future. Anyway guys, that's all and I'll see you next time. Peace.